Soul, this traveling businessman, is in Chicago, right? So the traveling businessman jumps into a taxi cab and the traveling businessman says to the taxi cab driver, Hey man, I want some action. Take me to the biggest whorehouse in town. So the taxi cab driver drops the businessman off at the entrance of City Hall. That's right, at the entrance of City Hall. And the businessman is looking up at this big immense building. It's 10 stories tall. It's got big Roman columns. It's this City Hall building. It takes up a whole city block. And the businessman, the traveling businessman is like, wow, this is the biggest whorehouse I've ever seen. And that's saying something, because the traveling businessman had been all over the world. So anyway, the traveling businessman walks into City Hall, and he opens the first door that he comes across. And he opens the door, and the businessman is surprised by what he sees. The businessman sees Three city employees beating up a man in a wheelchair. And the businessman is like, Wow, that's really, that's really kinky. And he, and he asks, Hey, is this where the, where the uh, action is? Because I want to do some immaculate conception. Yeah. And the city, and the three city employees that are beating up the man in the wheelchair are like, no, um, this is the mayor's office on people with disabilities. So the businessman says, oh, I'm sorry. And then the businessman closes the door and starts to walk along in the city hall building. And then the traveling businessman, he comes across another door. And he opens that door and he sees 100 bureaucrats sitting around and doing nothing. And the businessman, he asks the 100 bureaucrats sitting around and doing nothing, he asks them, hey, is this where the action is? I want to be fruitful and multiply, multiply just like in the Bible. And the 100 bureaucrats sitting around and doing nothing respond, no, um, this is the office of 100 bureaucrats sitting around and doing nothing. So, the businessman says, I'm sorry, and he closes the door, and he keeps on walking. Then, the traveling businessman comes across a third door, and he opens the door, and then the businessman has a big smile on his face because the businessman sees all of the city's politicians and all of the city's wealthy people all having a big orgy together. Yeah. And the traveling businessman jumps right into the orgy and he has a great time here in Chicago. All right. Well, I hope you've enjoyed today's, I hope you've enjoyed today's civic lessons with your Professor Wolf. And besides being a comedian, I am also an author. This is one of my books of A Big Cannibalistic Blue, and it's short monologues. It's by me, Wolf Larson, and, um... It's, uh, it's uh, available on Amazon.com really cheap. Uh, short monologues, a big cannibalistic blue on Amazon.com. Well, hey, it's been uh, nice uh, giving you this uh, uh, civics lesson today. Uh, I'm Professor Wolf, and um, yippee!